Hey everybody and uh, welcome back to my last video. I said I had three things that I had recently acquired that I was really excited about and I introduced two of them. This right here, this is the third um, relatively, I guess, recently uh, was my birthday and my wife got me this. This is going to uh, help us get our, our very first uh, homestead livestock, if you will. Now I know a bunch of people out there will say, "Hey, don't don't go too big with your first animals." I, I think I've taken that to heart. I know a lot of people, a lot of people recommend chickens or quail for your first animal. Some people, I know a, a friend of mine, actually they're doing rabbits or have done rabbits. Anyway, um, no, that's I didn't go with any of that. Instead. I got worms. That's right. This is a uh, vermiculture or worm compost setup. So stand by. I will do a very quick unboxing of this. There. It's out of the box. I haven't used it. I actually don't have the worms physically yet. Uh, don't worry, don't worry. I will get worms sooner or later. We were gonna have worms just absolutely coming out of our eyeballs with this thing. Um, that's the plan, anyway. The idea here is we're gonna use these guys, these little creepy crawlies, to, to build up the quality of our soil. Um, take table scraps, take whatever we can find. Um, I volunteer at a local food pantry, and one of the things that we we have is we have some of this produce come in uh, that is a little past prime, and uh, you know you look at it, you go, oh, I, I can't, I can't give this out. But this is this is insulting. This is disgusting. Um, well, I can't give that out to a human being. These guys don't care. They love it. So as long as I'm not giving them anything unhealthy, and they, I haven't read it yet, but they do have a little thing in here about, hopefully about how to not kill these guys. Um, but yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited. Got a base, got a, I think there's a little spigot that goes there. You can drain out all the, uh, now let's call it what it is, is worm pee. But it's, I'm hoping to use that around the, the edge of some trees. You saw those, uh, those pots in the last video. Those were actually some, uh, some apple trees that I'm, I'm messing around with planting. I say I'm messing around. Look, all I did, y'all, was I took a little pot and I took some apple cores that we had from, well, apples, and I stuck that bad boy in there. We're gonna see if they sprout. I left them out all winter, so whatever frost requirements they have, they should be good to go. Anyway. I'll probably use the uh, the liquid for that, and then use the solids in those raised bed gardens that I mentioned earlier in the last video, or use those pallets to build them. So anyway, I'm I'm really excited. They got like some old newspaper in here and uh, some other. I don't even know. Uh, it says rock dust. I have no idea what it is. Anyway, um, I'm excited about this. Oh, hey. Um, ladies, if your guy asks, you know, puts on his, his wish list some really weird thing, like, I don't know, worms, he's probably serious. All right, he probably really wants, that's probably the perfect thing to get him. Um, so, hey, I just got to brag a little on my wife because she is wonderful. Having said that... She has also told me she wants absolutely nothing to do with any kind of livestock, anything. So I'm, I may or may not get this fired up and built up before I leave uh, to go do army stuff. Um, we'll see. I'll talk it over with her. <laughs> uh, I think she read an article about egg-bound chickens one time, and she just said nope and checked out of any kind of interest in... Um, any kind of livestock, but we'll see if we we'll see if I can get her to do these. I, I, she likes the idea of, of recycling the you know, the wasted uh, table scraps and other stuff. So hoping hoping I can get her to go along with it. 
I don't know. We'll try it out. Maybe I get one of my kids to do it while I'm gone. Maybe not. Maybe I'll just wait and uh, get some of these guys going uh, when I come back. We shall see. Anyway, um, until next time, get out there, do cool stuff, and uh, most importantly, y'all take care of each other. All right? Worms.